Okay guys, welcome to a quick OBS tutorial just on this glitch I have had before. So, if I just bring up a new window of Safari, this is the problem I've had before. So, if I just add uh, a window capture and then I go onto window capture and let's just put slither.io because this is the game that I was doing it on so then I go I click Safari and then I click OK so let's just move this quickly and so this is what this is what I have I have Google and then what happens is I go into full screen and then if I go across as you can see it zooms in on the top uh, left that's because when I full screen it, it like gets bigger and therefore the, the document gets bigger so what I found on this is if you have a trackpad you get you four fingers on the trackpad and just swipe uh, either way just until you get to your desktop with OBS which is recording on it and then what you do is you grab this and you just go and fit it to the screen so here um okay oh yes so here i have this let's just remove it so as you saw it was big before and then if i just do this it fits to the screen and if I go back into my full screen uh, window and I minimize it, as you can see, it grow it goes smaller. But that doesn't matter because um, when you're recording, you should have full screen all the time, and then just stop recording and then come out of it. So then, when you're recording, it's not like uh, massive or tiny. So you just keep it in full screen, or if you just don't want full screen at all, you just keep it as a window like this and then you just fit it to the screen so yeah hope you guys enjoyed this um oh wait and i also have one more thing so there is um if you ever ever had a problem where you can record a video but you can't watch it back that's because if you go to settings and then output your recording format needs to be one of these that you can play on your computer so if on your computer so if you have windows uh, either mp4 or movie because you can play movie and mp4 on those uh, it's usually on this which does not work at all it, it needs to be on mp4 that works on all of them but if you have a different format they want it to be just put it if it's down on this drop, list, drop down list then just tick whichever one you think is more, most compatible with your computer I'm just using MP, mp4 because it's um, compatible with most computers so um, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. Oh, wait, uh, if you guys didn't see that, I'll just do it again. So I'm going to capture. I can. Just, okay. Oh, yes. Okay. Here we go. Okay. So. Yeah. So here is your OBS. And you want to go um, and change it you go to settings and you go on to output I can't see this so let's go okay you, if you you guys probably can't see this but you go into settings and down on the left hand side there should be uh, seven different uh, lists and you click on the one that says output, which is like a triangle with a dot at the top with uh, two circles around it. You click on that and on the recording, uh, on the recording bit down here, not the streaming, the recording section. And you go down to recording format and in here uh, you click the drop down list and it, it comes up with the, all of these. Uh, all of these. So L FLV, MP4, MOV. Um, MKV, TS, and M3U8. Um, I'm using MP4 because it's compatible with most computers. So, 
Choose just just choose whatever one is compatible with your computer. It's usually on FLV, but that doesn't that isn't compatible with um, a Mac if you're using QuickTime Player to play it. So, hope you guys enjoyed this quick video slash tutorial um, of how of how to fix the um, Safari glitch and how to um, just change the um, format of your uh, recording. So th thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and like, subscribe if you uh, have any other problems on OBS or you have any ideas for videos I could do. Please comment below. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed.